So the concept behind Walker is vintage is, um, well, just what you see here. Uh, we're an art gallery celebrating the artistry of vintage guitars and vintage cars. The passion ran through me from you know my earliest memories for both. I've, uh, I grew up in a, a car family. My father was a car dealer. My uh, grandfather was a car dealer. Um, I was always surrounded by cars. Uh, I was brought home from the hospital when I was born in 1970 in a DiTomaso Pantera. So my first experience in a car was a 351 Cleveland throwing me against the uh, seat. Uh, I'm sure no, uh, no child seat either back then. We have a beautiful collection of relevant and interesting collectible cars, cars that we like to have and offer a history on them. Uh, rare cars like a 58 uh, 250 Testarossa, which is the top of a Ferrari technology back in the 50s. Cars like this went to Le Mans, went to the, uh, different uh, international events and won. The Miami Vice Testarossa actually belongs to a local uh, collector. Uh, it's um, the actual car. There was two cars uh, that Ferrari gave to Universal Studios in, I believe, 1986. We also have uh, race cars like this 1976 Porsche 935. This is an FIA historic car. This car uh, has many podiums in its history. It did second place in GT Le Mans in 1976 and it's actually the World Endurance Champion in 1979 with Don Whittington. This car has podiums in uh, Spa, Nürburgring, Mon uh, Monza, Le Mans of course, and the World Endurance Championship. I am a die-hard Porsche fan. I am a, an air-cooled 911 junkie. It's, uh, it's what I live, breathe, sleep, eat is uh, a Porsche. If it wasn't for Bernard, our curator, we'd be standing in a, either an empty room or a room full of air-cooled pre-74 pre 911s. We also have interesting cars. Uh, that you could see in movies like the 250 uh, California Spider. This car, a model like this was used for Ferris Bueller Day Off. Uh, people like this car a lot. It's a very iconic Ferrari from the 60s besides being a very rare, beautiful car. Every guitar, every car is hand-picked, hand-curated, uh, and if it ends up on our floor, you can be sure that it's a very special piece that you really can't find uh, anywhere else. <laughs>